Hello everyone, welcome to my Sister Wives Official. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Janelle Brown has disclosed where she is presently living during her ongoing financial fight with her ex-husband Cody. The Sister Wives star recently spoke open about her troubles with the family patriarch after their huge argument left her frightened about her future. Now Janelle has addressed her present living circumstances in a recent comment made on Instagram. On Monday, the reality star resorted to her profile to broadcast a holiday video with her followers. In the clip, the TV celebrity sipped coffee out of a mug while looked away into the distance. Janelle snuggled up in a burnt orange t-shirt and a white sweater, with her blonde hair fashioned in a bob and little glam makeup. She wrote above the post, It's a cool, windy, wet afternoon in Flagstaff. Decided to take a few minutes to decompress after a fantastic weekend and let the stillness feed my soul. In a book I'm reading right now the characters are in New England and always having maple syrup lats, so I made my own version, with a smiley face emoji and two fall leaf emojis. Janelle wrapped up the clip by smiling at the camera and added in the caption, I'm reading Happy Place by Emily Henry, and in the chapters I read last night they kept talking about maple syrup lats, so I made one to drink on this afternoon, but I prepared mine using maple flavor and some Jordan's sugar-free simple syrup. Taking a minute early afternoon to sit quiet really helps get the creative part of my brain going, and I gear up to get more work done the rest of the day. But many were more distracted by Janelle's whereabouts in the video, as they remarked that she was still in Flagstaff, where she lived with her husband Cody before their breakup. You still live near Cody? They inquired in the comments area, gaining numerous likes and reactions as others waited to hear an answer. But deep in the answers, the TLC star clapped back, writing, I live near my three youngest children who are still in Flagstaff. Not everyone wants to leave their kids in hometown. Janelle's reaction garnered nearly 800 likes as many fans were startled to see that she is still live close her ex, despite their breakup in December. Ad assistant dis TVL. Last month, the U.S. Sun exclusively discovered that the mother of six still owns the $170,000 Coyo Pass property with her ex-husband Cody, despite renting her own little apartment in Flagstaff, Arizona. In the current season of Sister Wives, viewers observed the downfall of Janelle and Cody's marriage. Janelle revealed on the broadcast following their blow-up fight. I have nothing financially. I am tied up with this property. Everything as far as my estate goes. Any form of savings, money, and everything is tied up in this property. I am a smart woman and I have done this very dumb thing. I trusted in this family structure, but now I'm really stuck. I'm 50 and I have nothing. The U.S. Sun exclusively uncovered, according to Arizona property records, that Janelle and Cody still hold the plot of land in their name, said she has not sold it to him. The father and his then-wives purchased four plots of land called Coyo Pass in Flagstaff, Arizona for $820,000 in 2018 when the family moved from Las Vegas, Nevada. The father of 18 wanted to split the property into five parts, as he and his now three ex-wives Mary, Janelle, Christine, and his last-standing wife Robin could build residences. The U.S. Sun earlier said Cody and Janelle paid off the plot of land in their name on June 2, 2023, and an additional plot in Robin's name that was purchased for $170,000 each. The deed of release and full reconveyance for both lots received by the U.S. Sun claimed the amount owed to Fidelity National Title Agency was entirely paid on June 2, 2023. The amount of $146,200 was owing on the properties to Fidelity National Title Agency as a down payment of $23,800 was made. One of the lots purchased on June 25, 2018, was in Janelle and Cody's names, while the second was in Robin and Cody's names. J. N. E. L. E. Brown has spent some time in Sin City for a charity event not long after she split from her ex-husband Cody Brown. The 54-year-old Sister Wives star attended a fundraiser for Fork Cancer. Janelle's daughter-in-law Michelle, who was married to her son Logan, was involved with the event. In the caption of the Instagram image, Janelle said, I wouldn't have missed it fun company, amazing food and beverages, and the perfect Vegas location. 
She also shared a photo with her dear friend Alice, whom she got to speak up with. The TLC star revealed that her son Hunter couldn't make it to the event because of a business situation. In the images, Janelle was gleaming under the neon lights of Las Vegas. She was wearing a gorgeous knee-length blue dress with buttons down her chest. Janelle also tweeted a video of the late-night party she attended at a rooftop bar. Flowing. Fans on social media appreciated seeing this aspect of Janelle's life, and many say she appears happier without Cody. One said, I adore watching you living your best life and making your kids a priority. Another said, You look so joyful. Congratulations on reinventing your life. A third said, Janelle is just shining. Baby, there is nothing better than staying hydrated and decorating yourself in bliss and calm. Keep going, Janelle. We are all rejoicing on this new chapter of your life. Someone said, You are so glowing and gorgeous, Janelle. I hope you see it and feel it. You actually emit light. Stilopi, the cameras. Earlier this month on an episode of the reality television show, Janelle got into an intense dispute with Cody that culminated with her demanding producers to shut off the cameras. The dramatic scenario saw Janelle and Cody seated on a sofa in Arizona at wit's end. I feel like I'm being gaslit, Janelle continued, before being abruptly cut off by Cody. You're using that because I use the term, he lashed back. After some heated conversation, Cody went on to say that Janelle doesn't follow the rules and doesn't take accountability. At that point, Janelle blew up and pointed a finger, saying, Shut your fucking mouth and let me talk to you for a minute. Cody eventually threw on his jacket and claimed all of their issues were Janelle's doing. There is only a bitterness. What partnership do we have? As Cody prepared to leave the room, she grabbed his jacket. You stay and talk. F you. Janelle ended. Cody slammed the door, and Janelle begged the producers, shut it off. Sister Wives season 18 is going strong, but it was taped a long time ago. Now fans are asking if a Christine Brown and David Woolley wedding special is coming next. In the current season, Christine is just starting to date, so she hasn't even met David yet. In real time, this couple recently got married last weekend. Christine Brown gets married. Last weekend, Christine Brown was married to the love of her life, David Woolley. This was after breaking free from polygamy and choosing that she wanted to be married to a man who only had one wife. Her family was present, but Janelle Brown was the only one of her sister wives that was there for the major event. Viewers want to observe who was there and how they interacted with each other. You can see a picture from the big day below that Christine Brown tweeted showing off her wedding dress. Will this be a wedding special? A rare picture from the wedding reveals that there are cameras at the ceremony. This suggests they were filming and it was presumably for a wedding special. You can see it in the picture below. You know that TLC is not going to pass up a tremendous opportunity like this one. They made a wedding special for Emmy Roloff and Chris Merrick that fared fantastic. You can guess this will wind up showing a few months after the season finale of season 18 of Sister Wives, but that has not been confirmed just yet. It is apparent that something like this would attract massive numbers, and they are not going to pass that up. The fans want to see it, and David has already demonstrated that he isn't afraid of the cameras being spotted filming. She was also shielded by police at the wedding. You can presume that was because they didn't want somebody breaking in and disturbing up her big day or messing up her filming. TLC made sure that everything went properly for Christine Brown's special day. Film you believe that TLC will film a major wedding special for Christine Brown and David Woolley. Sound off in the comments below and don't miss new episodes of Sister Wives on Sunday nights at 9 p.m. Central Standard Time on TLC. This season seems to be roughly halfway finished so far. So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.